Fishy friends, welcome on another Fishy Friday here at Bart's Fish Tales. And today I've got this amazing fish. It's a trout, it's a farm fish. And you can make many, many different uh, delicious recipes with it. And it's affordable. And as you might know, I'm traveling the world in the search for uh, sustainable fishing communities out of the wild. But the world population is growing, the demand for seafood is growing, and therefore it's so important that we will focus on farm fish too. And therefore we have traveled and we will travel to some amazing places around the globe where they farm fish in the right way for the future. And this time we went to Greece for this super fantastic trout. We are at Eurotrout Farm in uh, just outside Preveza. I'm Christos Kenurius, the president of the company. We are standing just outside the building where we have the hatchery, where is the first step where we receive uh, the eggs. They hatch inside the building, and after a month, we move them outside to the outside tanks where we have the pre-growing and grow-out uh, facilities. The farm is certified for Global Gap for AESC as the first farm in Greece and uh, recently uh, it was certified as uh, the, the first organic farm. So the, the, this farm is organic according to EU regulation. We are at the hatchery where the, the eggs arrive, uh, the water goes underneath and uh, suspend all the eggs, uh, delivering uh, enough with oxygen until they hatch and they became fish. Okay, here we are at the second stage where we have the pre-growing facilities. The fish from inside, from two grams, we grow them up to 10 grams in these six tanks by adding them fresh water of constant temperature all year round. Here we are at the springs, uh, where the water are coming out from the uh, mountain. It's super saturated with uh, air, so that's why it's bubbles. It's making a stream and uh, we uh, introduce uh, the water after 500 meters from here into our farm. That's the, the distance. The water is uh, clear and uh, all the population in the coast, from Parga to Preveza, they are drinking uh, water coming from here. This is the third step where we feed the fish, are coming in from 10 grams and they're growing until 200 grams before we move them to the second level behind you. Here applies the same, the water is self-cleaning, discharging all the unnecessary gases. Once a day we lower the tanks also and we are cleaning. So this is the final fourth step, big fish from above 200 grams up to one and a half kilo. All the water afterwards via sedimentation tank, it goes in for watering all the cornfields around. So all the ammonia that it's created, it's used going recycled back to the cornfield. Wow, this was an amazing story out of Greece and I'm so happy to see that Christos and his team are taking care for the future by farming fish in a very responsible way. Guys, I became very hungry. It's now time to start cooking this super trout. If you want to see a trout recipe, click here. Any comments, any questions, please leave them down in the box below. Um, and if you want to see me travel around, traveling around the globe in a search for sustainable seafood, uh, please subscribe to my channel. Hope to see you soon on another Fishy Friday. Bye bye. <laughs>